point fighting. This is well. Not only that, you know they got they've uh, changed some of the rules now. No, I didn't know. Yeah, there's a good video. Uh, Big John McCarthy on the new M Big John McCarthy new MMA rules or okay. something like that. Okay. YouTube it. It's a good video. Yeah. Uh, one of the things that they've changed, and maybe that'll be a subject for next time to go into more details. But one of the things that they changed is uh, impact or or. They didn't. He didn't use the word damage. He used yeah. the word effect or something effect. like that. Yeah, yeah. Um, where basically he said, you know, if uh, fighter A jabs fighter B eight times, but fighter B rocks, you know, fighter A three times, <laughs> fighter B gets that. <laughs> Did they break down the exact ratios? Of, uh... No, they didn't. It wasn't like a specific percentile, like a one to ten or whatever. But I think it's just generalizing. Yeah. Don't count more uh, soft soft hits yeah. versus less large hits. Go by the 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 weight of where you should put the advantage. Yeah. Should go by the effect that yeah. the hits have. You should check that link out. Maybe you can post it. Yeah, yeah. that'll be a good idea. Yeah. I'll probably uh, post. Yeah, I'll, I'll post it in the description box. Did they cover um, ground? Like, did they have any rule, rules to stop the lay and pray? And um, not to, to stop it so much, but they definitely said that they should favor who is going for the finish. So if you're on your back and, you know, you have a lay and pray fighter on top of you, but you're going for its nice. submissions, yeah, cause nice. like you're the nice. one looking for the finish off your back, nice. the favor yeah. goes to that, because the advantage nice. goes to that guy. Nice. 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 I've been saying that for a long time. I think yeah. the reason that the people don't like to see, and I'm talking about the layman as opposed to people who actually fight themselves but the reason 80% of MMA fans don't like grappling is because people are scared the, the fighters because they're not being rewarded for mm -hmm. for you know attempting submissions especially when you're sweaty and stuff you know like when you're in an MMA ring it's, it's, it's a lot harder to get submission off your, off your back but yeah. the fact that people are trying it makes the sport more entertaining and yeah. ultimately when you're an athlete you are an entertainer. Yeah. Your job as an MMA yeah. fighter is to entertain the fans. It's not... Winning really is secondary. Your People want to see a fight, you know? You know yeah. what I'm saying? So Absolutely. That, you know, they have to... I'm glad that they, they jiggled the rules around a little bit because I mean, we want to see people going for omoplatas and... Hell yeah, dude. You know, all the crazy shit 10th Planet are coming up with and making up their own submissions and... You know, we want to see people rolling around and trying things. Yes, yeah. dude, sitting on someone for, you know. Yeah, they, it it definitely stifles the grappling portion. Yeah. Of, of the sport, if if being aggressive with your submissions and looking to finish is out is out pointed by simply like holding. Yeah. You know. Yeah. I, I get that you're dominating the person. I get that you, you know, get points for top position. Like yeah. he's in yeah. the, the more beneficial position. Yeah, for sure. But if you're not looking to do anything with it, right. Then Yeah, yeah exactly. That doesn't really mean anything. Yeah. You know You already have a big advantage with the with the strikes. You know, you always have the big advantage with being on top. But mm -hmm. if you're laying there and you're not striking them then you know, like when I when when we roll, if someone's on top of me, someone gets top position. If they're bigger or they just got a takedown and they're sitting on me, I do nothing. I just wait until they try something. Mm -hmm. That's my stuff because they're not doing any damage. I don't mind. I can stay on my back. Personally, that's how I roll. And I think a lot of guys, jujitsu guys, are like that. Yeah, you're not doing anything. All right, you got the position, you got the points already. But if you're not going to try anything from there, then I'm, I'm not really I'm in not, any danger. Yeah, I'm not in any danger. I just There's chill, no pressure. get my breath back. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, another thing they uh, they changed up was the uh, what what qualifies as a grounded opponent. Yeah. So um, simply reaching down and touching the floor oh, with your hands, stop the knees, and no stuff. longer yeah. grounded opponent. You yeah. can get kicked in the face. You can get knee in the face with the one handed touch. Um, Ooh, basically, nice. Nice. you have to have. Uh, I think all, f I, I don't remember whether it's all four. I think it's just the one. The The three-point rule is no longer in effect. Oh, okay. Um, so also, two hands. I think it's two hands or uh, like you're on your butt or like down on your knees. Right. But the one-handed thing, one-handed touch is no longer 
gonna stop you from I catching the yeah because that was kind of i mean you, dudes were just like yeah yeah i'll just chill here for a second finger yeah. on the ground one finger on the ground no question. no question and there's a lot of people that were getting where it was kind of borderline yeah like they would send the knee and then he would touch it real quick right yeah. and then at that point it's, it's a hard call for the ref yeah because if the, if the kick is already in motion right and you happen to reach down as the kick is coming you can't really <laughs> Fault the yeah. the aggressive fighter for that, yeah. and then if he gets stunned, then they have to call the what they have to call the fight. I'm sure that happened a couple of times where they called the fight because the dude was like, "Oh, I can't carry on." Yeah, no you question. I think that's a, that's a good call on their yeah. on their behalf. Yeah. Um, yeah. Another thing they're changing is, and uh, it's going to be interesting to see how this affects Jones. Although I'm sure he'll get around it. Who? Uh, John Bones Jones. Who's that? Who's that? John Jones. <laughs> He's oh, been yeah. gone for a while. Yeah, yeah I remember. Um, the out, outstretched fingers. Oh yeah, they're they're coming down a lot harder on that. No eye pokes. Uh, what basically what they said is, if you're reaching out, you're fine to reach out. You're fine to extend your hand to range find. But if your fingers are going in the direction of the person's face, you're getting a warning. Yeah, and if without even without even eye poke or not, yeah. if you get caught just kind of doing that, yeah, that's so what you're supposed warning. to do, close your fingers when you do it. Uh, yeah, yeah, I guess that's either hard. fingers up, although that's a little iffy. That's a little hard uh, because in the heat of things, you know, I can you can you're, easily. You're also in a bad position anatomically. Like yeah, you you're, can you're, get you your can fucking hand, hand busted up. Yeah, it's not a good position to have. Um, but I think probably just closed fist. Closed fist, yeah. Uh, yeah. yeah, that's going to be an adjustment for sure. Yeah, it's gonna for be sure. An and you do lose a couple inches, yeah, by bringing your your fingers in. That that's way. true, but it was like at least every card you'd get one eye poke. No question. It was, no question. It was annoying. No one wants to see that. No, and especially like when it's like uh, what's his name Belcher had his eye really fucked Ooh, up. Oh yeah, Bisping's one Bisping of his eyes is, fuck, is fucking milky. Right? Like yeah. that shit is just. He's like looking off in the other fucking direction. No, he's question. looking at you, and then he's looking at the. No, he's talking. Yeah, he's he's talking to Joe Rogan and looking at Dana White. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe yeah. Might yeah be so I'm I'm glad they're they're doing something about that. I still think they should probably switch up the gloves a little bit. Yeah, you know, find figure something out about that. Yeah. But I feel like that style of glove is so heavily branded with the UFC. They don't yeah. want to change it. Yeah, you know what yeah, I mean. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Plus, um, I mean what. I mean, it might hurt the grapplers if they start fucking with a glove as well. Yeah, maybe. I don't know what the specific proposal was to, to stop the eye pokes with the glove. Mm-hmm. I know there was a lot of talk about it, but, you know, you've got to, you, you know, you got to balance it out. Yeah, for sure. For sure.